Hey everybody, Charles Specht here, the President and CEO of Permission Network. And I want to talk to you a little bit about how to build a million dollar book of business through sign broker of record letters, because that's what I focus on when I'm working with, with insurance producers. But specifically, the topic has to do with why you? I mean, why you? Why exactly would an insurance buyer want to buy business, buy insurance from you rather than whoever they're doing business with right now? What is it that separates you? What is distinct about you and the services that you provide, about the agency that you're with, and so forth? Why you? Because if you can't really answer this question, it's going to be so very difficult for your insurance prospect to answer that question. Frankly, it's probably impossible for your prospect to answer that question. One of the first questions that I usually ask an insurance producer when I'm coaching him or her is this. Let's say, for example, that you set an appointment with a prospect, and so you're sitting down to meet with that prospect for the first time. Prospect really doesn't know too much about you, but you know, is there having a conversation with you, and about 10 minutes into the conversation says to you, let me ask you a question. Why should I fire who I'm doing business with right now as my insurance agent and hire you? Why should I hire you? And I ask insurance producers to answer that question for me. Why you? You know, many times they'll tell me, well, um, you know, we, we provide really good service and we've been in business for about 17 years. We have uh, a lot of expertise in a number of different areas. We have many different carrier appointments. Um, you know, I'm there to answer questions for you. I'm available, you know, on my cell phone and we will process certificates of insurance pretty quickly you know, and so forth. So they answer the question, why you, with answers that sound exactly like their current insurance agent. And because of that, there is no reason whatsoever based upon that answer why the insured would want to fire their agent and do business with you. It, it, it's probably one of the most important questions you could ever answer. You need to have a really good understanding of what separates you, what makes you distinct, what makes you and your services unique from the other offerings from your competitors who are out there. And let me just tell you, insurance buyers, commercial insurance buyers, are receiving phone calls from insurance agents like yourself all the time. Everybody sounds the same. Everybody says that they can provide a lot. Everybody says that they have lots of good things that they can offer to them. But at the end of the day, they sound and look like everybody else. Just a lot of ducks who sound like everybody else. And frankly, the insurance buyer, your prospect, they don't know if you are a good agent or a bad agent. They don't know if your agency is a good agency or a bad agency. They have no idea, frankly, if the carriers you represent are the carriers they need or not. You know, if you already talk about in a carrier like Travelers or Hartford or Chubb or Zurich or anything like that, you know, pick a carrier. They have no idea whether or not you're the right agent to even represent them. They don't know if you'd be able to get a good quote or a bad quote. They don't know if your agency has any leverage based upon potentially writing $50 million of premium with that carrier or if you're an agent who's about to lose their appointment with that, with that carrier in the next 30 days because nobody from your agency has been writing business with them. You see, the thing is, is that your prospects don't know how to choose an agent. They don't know how to find out who's good and who's bad. And so everybody talks, but very few actually differentiate. And so the question, why you? That is a question that you really need to figure out because if you can't define it, if you can't clearly describe to your prospect, why they should do business with you, let me just tell you, your prospect's not going to be able to figure it out. They're not going to be able to decide how you are better. And if you don't have a really good question, they're going to come in their mind, they're going to think, hmm, why would I fire whom I've been doing business with for four years to do business with someone who basically does the same thing my current agent does? Or why would I do business with this agent when everybody else says the, says the exact same thing. That really is the biggest issue. And so when you answer that question, you know, why you? When you answer the question, what is it that you provide that somebody else would say, that's very interesting. When you answer that question, it has to have a very distinct, clear, unique ROI. 
The insured needs to be able to see what the value is, what they would get out of the relationship. Why you? And so I don't know exactly what it is that you would offer. I don't know what would differentiate you. But maybe, maybe it would be something like this. It's a great question, Bob. I really appreciate you ask, asking that question because I think that a lot of insurance agents really don't know how to define what differentiates them from the competition. So let me just say this. You're a, an organization that erects steel products into buildings. You do a lot of uh, fabrication. You do even some of the manufacturing. You do a lot of the installation. Here's the thing. I've been doing steel framing contractors now for about six years. Um, we actually write 32 steel framing companies that are in the state and as well as some that are outside of the state. I know which insurance carriers are actually writing the insurance right now for your state. I can even put them together for you in, in order of preference. In fact, on my timeline of services, as you see on this piece of paper, I've actually outlined the seven carriers who are going to be most competitive for you on your general liability. I even know exactly how many accounts we have with each and every one of them. I know the difference between which exclusions come from each of the carriers. But even more than that, I actually know how to make sure that the underwriters will begin competing for your business. Because at the end of the day, the insurance policy is important. Don't get me wrong, it is important. But how I, as the agent, actually go in and negotiate on your behalf to ensure that you're going to get the absolute best quote possible from these carriers. We are in the industry. I understand steel. I even look at the price of steel every day. I see that it went up two cents since yesterday. I know that that's actually continuing to go up even because of the problem we're having right now in COVID. And so when you're doing business with me, you're not necessarily doing business with somebody who's just in the insurance business. You're doing business with somebody who's in the steel business. And I happen to have a very, very good expertise in understanding steel insurance. And frankly, we know that we are second to none. We know that we have the, the understanding that this industry needs. We're in the association. We're actually even endorsed by the association. And so because of that, we feel that we are the go-to agent to most adequately represent every single steel framing contractor that's out there in the state. That's why you should be doing business with me. So depending upon what kind of industry you're going after and depending upon what kind of business you're going after, being able to define and answer the question, why you? It's probably one of the most important things you could ever do. Again, everybody, my name is Charles Specht. I am the president and CEO of Permission Network, where I teach insurance agents, insurance producers, how to build a $1 million book of business through signed broker of record letters. Go check out my website, www.permissiongroup.com, and we will see you soon. Bye-bye.